Hello, hello, hello. This is Jenna Cantor. I'm all about physical therapy and the performing arts, and I'm the founder of Powerful Performer. Today I'm talking about my membership renewal, membership renewal. Okay, so there's a purpose to this. It's not like, oh, yay, I'm paying a bill, but it is. It is. I am going from student to professional physical therapist. I graduate in May. I'm taking the big NPTE exam, which I know is just going to be such a lovely, calming experience um, at the end of July. Well, my membership renewal is already up. And so I'm like, all right, this is the question. I don't have, for me at my school, I don't have them looking over me saying, oh, it's time. You've got to do your membership re renewal. We require it. No, no, it's up to me. I am excited about this. This is going to help continue keeping me as part of this family that's just regularly making and trying to make a difference. Yes. Sign me up. How do you think the nurses union came about and it's so strong? You gotta start somewhere. Come on, people. All right, so I see here, I still, as a student, I still get student prices, which is very kind, and I do appreciate that. And so I get 50% off my national dues and even my, my state dues as well. I get 50% off. That's really good. It's really good. So for me, uh, and originally it would be 295 a year for the national dues, worth it. And uh, as a student just graduating, I don't have my regular income yet. It's 148, worth it. New York, New York chapter dues for a year, 180, with if I'm not a student. And then as a student, I get half off, so 90. Either price, worth it. You guys hear me? Either price worth it. I'm not speaking naively. I'm speaking with a very, very clear head. They're not just asking for money to ask for money. When the, when an organization like this is, you know, doing all these things in their power to get more students and more professionals to join, and they're not really changing their prices, there's a reason. They need the money. They need the funding. Money just doesn't come out of nowhere. Most of the people in these leadership positions that you see aren't getting paid a single cent. So you got to like, you got to think, you got to think that way because the APTA is extremely valuable, extremely important. So these are, these are the costs. I was, I remember I had uh, one person, professional physical therapy talking to me about how the price is outrageous. I just, I just can't, I can't pay that. You know, I can't do that. I'm doing these other things with my paying for off my debt and everything. Well, you know what? There's a loan, uh, 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 not a loan. There's a bill that's where we're fighting to get make that change. Oh, speaking of bills, speaking of bills, when you don't know where to donate, literally, I just, I never really looked at this before because I always paid things separately, but there's voluntary, there's a voluntary contribution section and there is the PT pack. Is right there you can they give some suggestions or other so if you are always going oh where oh I always forget just do it now do it during your renewal and that's great so then you can support that and also the New York for me my state is on there as well I didn't realize that I paid separately but look at this this is so fantastic I'm just gonna use this next year and just be like oh, I'll just pay at my renewal and so they make it so convenient for you and it's not something to go of course they do no, it's good. That's helpful. They they help you help. This this it's a beautiful thing. It's a truly truly beautiful thing. And you can pay in full. And if you're a person where you're like, oh, you know, I can't pay that much all at once, you can do uh, pay my dues in, in four months. It's great. This is this is wonderful. It's worth it. I'm extremely, I'm extremely happy to be handing over some funds to such an important organization the APTA is so valuable and I I thought from hearing people that I looked up to not many um, I thought when, when speaking to people I looked up to that renewing would be a thing financially for me to go this is now I know what they feel no no I don't feel that way I don't and I don't even have a job and I don't feel that way that's a big deal. That's a big difference. And 
it's unfortunate that there, if I was just going to focus on the professionals alone, that there are so many professionals who are not members of the APTA. I've definitely experienced that when putting together conferences and getting speakers, we've had to eliminate amazing speakers because they were not members of the APTA. And these are people that I look up to and think are just so knowledgeable. Of course, you know, they're, people were asking to be speakers. So there's just this level of, ah. Um, and I just, it really disappoints me. It really disappoints me. If you're somebody going around and speaking, be a member. Be a member. You're, you being a speaker and not being a member is basically prom subconsciously, even if you're not saying it out loud, is subconsciously promoting other people to not be a member. And it just trickles down and creates a really bad cascade of non-membership. The ABTA is doing a great job at promoting and just trying to constantly prove that they're valuable. They're valuable. Like, you, they, they've made, there was somebody who wrote lists of all these things that they do for you. My one is the bigger picture of we do not have a union. The APTA is what we got. That's valuable. I think that pretty much says it all. Yes, they have all these other services and stuff, but that's a big deal. You need an organization backing you up. These things don't, things, changes don't happen. Improvements don't just happen out of thin air. You, yeah, you could start another group when nobody pays dues, but good luck starting that all over. That That's that's a pain. Come on, APT exists. Let's bounce off these wonderful shoulders that we already have. So if you are, I'm just going to get real specific. If you are a professional, somebody who's a leader, who's coming forward and teaching or speaking at events or mentoring other students and you're not a member of the APTA, and even if you're somebody who might be a mentor of mine, I have many wonderful mentors, and you're hearing that you're going, oh, I'm one of those people. Dude, become a member. You got, th this is, we, we're all in this together. So, yeah, that's it. I hope that you might feel even a twinge of my excitement going, yeah, you know what, she's right. Like, APTA, I, I, these dudes, this is a steal. I haven't even looked. I, to full honesty, I have not even looked at what the dues are for any other type of groups, for other pro medical professions, whatever. I don't care. That is a waste of time. Yeah, you can go, oh, they're paying less, or oh, they're paying more. It doesn't matter. The whole point is, this is the group. This is APTA is what represents us. And this is what we do. Aside from our actions, this is one of them, though. This is what makes the APTA stronger in a very, very good way. 